talking about the Lancaster homework just a little. We've got these two equations and therefore dy dx, you see the x's and the y's both cancel. You get negative c dy equals negative d dx. Integrating both sides, negative cy equals negative dx plus k. So dx minus cy equals k. And as for what k represents, well, we can let t be zero. If we call x of zero, x sub zero, and like y is y of zero, then k is this. So what these trajectories look like, they're just straight lines. I mean, this is, this is a linear. So straight lines coming in and hitting one of the axes. And let me take a look at this. Um, if k equals zero, then this line hits the origin. So as expected, I mean, in all the previous cases, which side one came down to something being positive or negative. And that seems to be the case here as well. If k is zero, both sides are wiped out. If k is either greater than zero or less than zero, then we wind up either up here, where our me x is wiped out or down here, where our me y is wiped out. And let me think this through. If k is greater than zero, then our me x is stronger than R me Y. So if K is positive, R me X wins. And if K is negative, R me Y wins.